Fantastic work by that team. And the peak of hurricane season is now just eight days away, and it certainly looks like that across the Atlantic. This is the latest update on Tropical Storm Nana. We just got that at 11 a.m. from the National Hurricane Center. It's been dealing with wind shear. That's been helping to at least limit the intensification of the system, but there has been a burst of convection. You can see that just over the last couple of hours. Its motion is to the west at 17 miles per hour right now. Maximum sustained winds of around 60 miles per hour. A hurricane warning was issued for Belize as there is the potential for this to barely make it to Category 1 status before it makes landfall in Belize later this week. That'll likely be happening at some point during the day on Thursday. So some wind and a lot of rain expected uh, with Nana. Omar is really struggle, struggling with wind shear at this point. In fact, the showers and thunderstorms, the convection associated with the system is being pushed about 100 miles away from the east of the center. That's always an indication that the wind is really pressing on the system. And this won't be with us for a whole lot longer as it heads out into the open Atlantic. Couple more areas to watch from tropical waves moving across the tropical Atlantic. Both have a decent chance of development over the next several days, but forecast models do look to turn the systems early. So some good trends with those, but of course we'll be watching those very closely for you.